Hey you guys, today we're gonna to be doing candied apple, Baldwin blackberry wine, and Oreo Boo Oreos. Now, I was gonna do a bunch of these candied apples here, but I'll get into that later. I wanna get started on eating first. Let us begin. Yeah, I saw this at uh, the Asian market, and I was just like, I really have to try some. This sounds really interesting. Cheers. It's like 9 a.m. We're having blackberry wine. <laughs> this is really good. Oh, and my hair today. You know, and this. I just thought, you know, if I was at Hogwarts and this is my house, this is Ravenclaw, so <laughs> I thought this is probably what I would wear. The earrings, probably it's the Yule ball. If that was in my lifetime, probably not. But in the necklace I got from my, um, and the earrings I got from my aunt. And yeah, I just like how pretty they are. They remind me of Ravenclaw and the diadem. I wear my hair up all the time. And then the jacket, I get so cold. And in the castle, it would be freezing. So yeah, it's supposed to be blue. But it came out a little purpley. Very good, I recommend this. It's very delicious. All right, moving on. To the candied apple because I know you all want to try a bite of this off oh, yeah we're just gonna just like that Boop. I wanted to do something different today and creative that's what I like doing <laughs> it doesn't always work out though the Ravenclaw I identify most with Luna she's one of my favorite characters if you've seen or read the books you know she is precious she views the world in a totally different way and her approach to life is much different than average. All right, this is gonna go everywhere. All right, so I got a little section out and I'm gonna take a bite. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> she sees others' needs and she brings it upon herself to fill those needs. Like in the Great Hall, when I saw that Harry wanted to be alone, she was like, oh, a snorkel or something. So that... Harry could go and find time alone. And I mean, that's not a normal way to do that. I don't know what a normal way to do that it would be like, just about being like blunt and being like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but yeah, she's different and her motive is spot on. Also see in the Battle of Hogwarts, it is my favorite moment of all time in the books. It's Oh, it gives me chills. All right, so Harry is fighting Dementors, and it's the Battle of Hogwarts, right? And he can't produce a Patronus. So Luna and a bunch of the DA members come running up, cast a Patronus, and Luna, think of something happy, Harry. Come on, I'm paraphrasing. And Harry's like, happy? And Luna's like, we're all still here. We're all still fighting. And I just get chills thinking about that. Despite Luna being different, she is the most caring, thoughtful, considerate, insightful, and she has this wisdom about her. And no matter how many times people are like, oh, here we go again, or blows her off, they, she still continues to be a strong, loyal friend and caring. I don't know if you remember in the books, but she, they go into her Luna's room when she's like, I think gets captured. Don't quote me on that. And she drew this mural of them on her wall. I think it's Ginny, Neville, Harry, Hermione, and Ron. And it looks like a gold chain's linking them all together, but it really just says friends. And it's this like floating gold chain of the word friends. And Harry's like, has a rush of affection for her because she's just a loyal spot on friend. I mean, even I'm like, I'm just gonna take this out. When Hermione said, Looney Lovegood, I would have kept that like, especially in high school, in the back of my mind, been like, 
at Hermione. But Luna knows. She's she's like, these are my friends. I'm gonna stay loyal to them, and I care about them. Not that I hold grudges. I just sort of like that. Sort of would have turned me off, and I wanted to be friends with them, even if I didn't have any friends. Mm. This is really good. I'll show you how I made this if you stay until the end. And going back to the first moment where with the Dementors, she's, she thinks very logically. So when she says, come on, think of something happy that's very, this is the need. This is the need of the time. We got to do it no matter how much like you feel defeated, Harry. And, and secondly, she's like very encouraging and knows what needs to be done. She uses her logic to encourage Harry, we're all still here, we're all still fighting, come on, you can do this, you know what I'm saying? So, it's just, I don't know, that's why I love Luna. And I think that's why I'm in Ravenclaw, because I'm someone truly different, I'm truly uniquely myself, and I refuse to change for anyone, and that's why I'm in Ravenclaw. Now, I did see that there is a new Wizarding World What's it called? Test, and I got the app. Now, I don't know if we'll get around to it this video, but I do want to take it. The test. I'm gonna break a tooth. <laughs> All right, mm. that was enough for that. Let's dig into these Oreos. So, how we made this is we took, first of all, we did a bunch of these. Now, we took a bunch of the corn syrup and sugar and we let it boil, but our candy thermometer broke. And also the site and the website didn't show us how long it took to cook. Accio milk. Wow, would you look at that? <laughs> and then and I was like, how, it's not turning blue. I mean, I'll show you it. Oh gosh, it looks gross. But it doesn't, yeah, they don't look blue. So we tried the blue sprinkles next. And if you can tell, they're still sticky. I'm gonna put these down before I drop them. And so next, I don't know if you guys can see that, but there's a spider web on the, like, these. Mmm, <laughs> very good. Um, I had a bunch of lo leftover Jolly Ranchers um, from Valentine's Day, actually. Mmm, I melted those. We poured it on the outside of the apple after washing and prepping them, yes. Did you dare to dunk it, <laughs> me to dunk it? <laughs> mm, I'm so funny. All right. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. This is very good. I like them. And it's orange cream. Very yummy. Mm -mm -mm. And then we just let it set. And it's set pretty good. I love blackberry wine. It's my new favorite now. <laughs> yeah, this is really good. I really enjoyed this. I already told you my Ravenclaw moment. And yeah, this is my last Halloween video. So, keep me in your prayers. Again, Luna is boss she's a boss babe <laughs> and this would be my outfit if i was wasn't i am in a raven claw and i went to the ball and or was just walking around the castle in my comfy sweater because castles are cold if you did not know that they are cold be uniquely you keep me in your prayers because my boot is gonna be painful and um oh and then also Tell me which video you liked the most. If you haven't seen my other videos, I will leave in the link below or stay till the end. And I will see you and have a wonderful Halloween. And goodbye. <laughs>